Happy Friday to you. If you did not know, today is National Soup Day, but before you raise a bowl, cup, or spoon, I thought it would be a great opportunity to meet a local soup maker who is helping the San Diego Food Bank with her freeze-dried creations. I'm talking about San Diego's Pat Lupica from Plant Pantry Soups. Good morning, Pat. We appreciate you being with us from your beautiful kitchen. Ah, thank you. Thank you for having me. This is such a cool opportunity. Not only are you helping out uh, the food bank, but also people can purchase these freeze dried soup mixes that you have. And we have one in front of us. I have one here with me. I think it's a chicken noodle one. It smells amazing. It's it's filling up the whole studio with your beautiful aromas. Uh, tell us how plant pa pantry came to be and, and how you got involved. Well, we, we, it started with family recipes in hand and the idea for the company actually started with a cooking date with my granddaughter who was all of five at the time. And so we went shopping, we brought the, the ingredients home, we made the soup, we sat down at the table and she took a bite. And these are all vegan and gluten-free uh, soups. And so we use nuts and seeds instead of dairy and gluten. And so she tried it and she looked up at me with her blue eyes and said, Grandma, you ought to sell this. And after I got over the shock of this little five-year-old uh, making this suggestion, I was like, hmm, maybe we ought to sell this. So there are a lot of other inputs into the business before we started and even after we you know, started and, and have been on our journey. But that is the point at which this company um, started really. And I mean, I think it, I feel like it's a different idea to have these freeze dried. I assume then that kind of elongates the shelf life of it and it especially helps those food pantries, right? It does. It does. So originally we started off uh, with refrigerated and frozen and I was actually in my kitchen trying to find, figure out a way to come up with healthy snacks for my mom, who is now almost 90. She had very uh, strict dietary requirements, uh, no sugar added, high protein, gluten-free, uh, no cholesterol. So I was eating a fruit roll-up and I thought, man, it would be great if I could freeze dry this soup because it meets her dietary requirements. And so I started playing with different um, methods of freeze drying. We figured it out. And then when COVID hit, it was just such a hard time, just like, you know, with, with most, especially small businesses, we decided to just pivot to the freeze dried. So that's where we are today. And yes, it has a longer shelf life. It's made with whole foods. So when we talk whole foods, we're talking whole foods, not extracts right. or uh, pieces or uh, fillers and flavor enhancers. It's using whole foods. So we use nuts and seeds. Uh, the whole, you know, the vegetables, the whole vegetables. And we make it just like that recipe that I used, I made with my granddaughter. And then it's freeze dried and then packaged. And I'm going to so try some So there's no this. preservatives. It's really um, dense with nutrition. I see. And, yeah. um, and it carrots, it's, it's, uh, celery. a lot of, of dairy ter dietary restrictions. I'm going to take a sip, uh, take a little spoonful of one of the soups that our producer Tiff prepared for us. While I do that, okay. tell us how you got involved with the San Diego Food Bank and how people can purchase your soups. Okay, so the Food Bank is one, it, they do such great work. And we have food, so they're a food bank, so it, it's a good fit. And it just is a way, an easy way for us to give back. So we've extended that giving opportunity. We've extended that to our customers because we took our top sellers and we, we put them on the website and you can see which ones are applicable. But if you buy one, we give one to the food bank. So it's just a, a great way to give back to our community, to people who just need, just need a little help. It's amazing. And you guys now, are out of terms, Oceanside. Go ahead. You guys are, are local out of Oceanside. We only have a few seconds left, yeah. Pat, but tell us uh, where people can go to purchase your product. So on the website, plantpantry.com, is there's actually a dash plant dash pantry.com uh, cream of the crop which is, they've been a, re, a small natural grocery store out of oceanside they've been our biggest supporters since we've started awesome and uh, we're also on amazon all right thank you so much pat we appreciate you being with us you can again find those products online looking so great and delicious too we'll be right back thank you so much thank